Against to the me. Lord. In Hear, this one thing Lord, will I be confident. When I cry with my one thing have I desired of the Lord. Mercy that will I seek after upon me and answer that me. I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life to behold the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in his temple. For in the time of trouble he shall hide me in his pavilion. In the secret of his tabernacle shall he hide me. He shall set me up upon the rock. Unto thee, O Lord, do I lift up my soul. O my God, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. But as for me, I will walk in mine integrity. Redeem me and be merciful. of my life, 
and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. hath clean hands and a pure heart, who hath not lifted up his soul unto vanity, nor sworn deceitfully, he shall receive the blessings from the Lord and righteousness from the God of his salvation. This is the generation of them that seek him, that seek thy face, O Jacob. Salah. Let us therefore fear, lest they promise, being left us of entering into his rest. Any of you should seem to come short of it, for unto us was the gospel preached, as well as unto them. But the word preached did not profit them, not being mixed with faith in them that heard it. For we which have believed do enter into rest. As he said, as I have sworn in my wrath, if they shall enter into my rest, although the works were finished from the foundation of the world. For he spake in a certain place on the seventh day on this wise, and God did rest the seventh day from all his works.
casting all your care upon him, for he careth for you. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour, whom resist steadfast in the faith, knowing that the same affliction are accomplished in your brethren that are in the world. But the God of all grace, who hath called us unto his eternal glory by Christ Jesus, after that ye have suffered a while, make you perfect, establish, settle, and strengthen you. Say not thou, I will recompense evil, but wait on the Lord, and he shall save thee. The heart of a king, yes, the king's heart is in the hand of the Lord. As the rivers of water, he turneth it whithersoever he will. Every man, his ways, every way of a man is right in his own eyes. But the Lord pondered the hearts. To do justice and judgment is more acceptable to the Lord than sacrifice. And high look and a proud heart and the plowing of the wicked is sin. The righteous man wisely considereth the house of the wicked, but God overthroweth the wicked for their wickedness. A wicked man hardeneth his face, but as for the upright, he directeth his way. There is no wisdom, nor understanding, nor counsel against the Lord. Be not a witness against thy neighbor without cause, and deceive not with thy lips. Be not thou envious against evil men, neither desire to be with them, for their heart studieth destruction, and their lips talk of mischief. Through wisdom is a house built, and by understanding it is established. And by knowledge shall the chambers be filled with all precious and pleasant riches. A wise man is strong, Yea, a man of knowledge, increased strength. For by wise counsel thou shalt make thy war, and in the multitude of counselors there is safety.
for a just man falleth seven times and riseth up, but the wicked shall fall into mischief. Rejoice not when thy enemy falleth, and let not thine heart be glad when he stumbleth, lest the Lord see it and it displease him, and he turn away his wrath from him. Fret not thyself because of evil men, neither be envious at the wicked. For there shall be no reward of the evil man. The candle of the wicked shall be put out. like no other peace in the middle of the storm peace in the middle of crisis peace in the middle of pain peace in the middle of what should and has said that will destroy you the peace of God which surpasses all understanding. Keep your heart and your mind 
in perfect peace. And for this we bless the name of the Lord God. We bless the name of the Lord God. We bless the name of the Lord God. Right where you are, lift your hands. Just lift your hands and tell God, thank you. Because God, I have you and you have peace. Therefore, I have peace. Now thank him. Thank you, God. We thank you, God. We thank you, God. For your peace, Lord. For your peace, Lord. For your peace, Lord. For your peace. For your peace. For your, for your, for your peace that you give to me because we are his dear children. He's a good, good father. Oh, we thank you. We thank you. We adore you. Thank you. Receive the peace of God. Say, I have the peace of God. I have the peace of God. I have the peace of God. Strength is yours. Strength be imparted into you. The strength of the Lord, receive it now.
joy of the Lord is your strength. Receive also the joy of the Lord. When we lose or if we give up our joy, we lose our strength. Receive joy. Speak it from your mouth. Decree it and declare it. The joy of the Lord is my strength. The joy of the Lord. 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 joy, strength. you have peace because you have joy and now because you have strength you shall you can make it For though we walk in the flesh, we do not war after the flesh. For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through God to the pulling down of strongholds, casting down imaginations and every high thing that exalted itself against the knowledge of God and bringing into captivity every thought to the obedience of Christ.
The Spirit of the Lord is upon me because he hath anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He has sent me to heal the brokenhearted, to preach deliverance to the captives, and recovering of sight to the blind, to set at liberty them that are bruised, to preach the acceptable year of the Lord. If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face and turn from their wicked ways, then will I hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and will heal their land. Heal me, O Lord, and I shall be healed. Save me, and I shall be saved, for thou art my praise. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all his benefits. Who forgiveth all thine iniquities, who healeth all thy diseases, who redeemeth thy life from destruction, crowneth thee with love and kindness and tender mercies. Give ear to my words, O Lord. Consider my meditation. Hearken unto the voice of my cry, my King and my God. For unto thee will I pray. My voice shall thou hear in the morning, O Lord. In the morning will I direct my prayer unto thee and will look up. For thou art not a God that hath pleasure in wickedness. Neither shall evil dwell with thee. The foolish shall not stand in thy sight. Thou hatest all workers of iniquity. Thou shalt destroy them that speak lacy. The Lord will abhor the bloody and deceitful man.
But they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. God is faithful by whom ye were called unto the fellowship of his Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. And he that searches the hearts knoweth what is the mind of the Spirit, because he maketh intercession for the saints according to the will of God. And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are the called according to his purpose. For whom he did foreknow, he also did predestinate to be conformed to the image of his Son, that he might be the firstborn among many brethren. Moreover, whom he did predestinate, them he also called, and whom he called, them he also justified, and whom he justified, them he also glorified. What shall we then say to these things? If God be for us, who can be against us? Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. For by it the elders obtained a good report. Through faith we understand that the worlds were framed by the word of God, so that things which were seen were not made of things which do appear. By faith, Abel offered unto God a more excellent sacrifice than Cain, by which he obtained witness that he was righteous, God testifying of his gifts, and by it he being dead yet speaketh. <laughs> 